Hello guys and girls, welcome to my channel if you're not new, but if you're new, welcome back. Not correct, other way around. Anyways, you got the message, right? Hello guys and girls, welcome to my channel. If you're new, if you're not, welcome back. Uh, enjoy the video, but don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you're not already. My name is Serdar Karazulov. I was fortunate enough to be able to travel many nice parts of the world. What happened is like I was in oil field recently in Dubai due to pandemic. I had to kind of push to be retired kind of early, but that's okay. Why? Because I decided to travel the world that I was planning a really, really long time. This trip will be like up to seven to eight months, incredibly affordable. It'll be like, again, uh, six continents, seven, eight months, 25 locations. I'll be starting from Istanbul, then Goa, then Kathmandu, then Nepal, obviously, uh, Thailand, then the Bali, then the Philippines, then the Beijing, Great Wall and everything, then Tokyo, then Bora Bora, then Lima, Machu Picchu, and then Santiago, Buenos Aires, Rio, Havana, London, Barcelona, Florence, then I'll go to South Africa, then go back to uh, Kilimanjaro, I need to see Kilimanjaro, Tanzania, then come back to Istanbul. The reason I'm asking you to follow me and then like my videos that every time I believe, every time you like my videos, that will remind you that one day you need to do the same trip for yourself, even better than I do. Just don't forget to subscribe and like my video. Welcome to my channel again. One of the most recognizable buildings of Istanbul is Galata Tower. And it's built in, I think, seven or 800 years ago by Genovians. It's the best, some of the best view of Istanbul. I think the best view of Istanbul is on the top of this building. Let's go check it out and try to find out if we can go up today. Because of the corona, we might not be able to go up there. But I see people up there. I'm really, really dying to go up there. Let's see if we can. It's, this is pretty cool. It says there, uh, 29 of May, uh, Sunday, uh, Tuesday, Genevians give the uh, keys of this tower to the Sultan Mehmet. Incredible. Turks get that building about 500 years ago. So it's pretty cool. Let's see what's going on up there. Oh well, yes, we arrived, let's see. Oh yeah, it's the best. There used to be a restaurant here a long time ago. Now it's only an uh, observation place, I believe. Best like the top of the world. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Absolutely breathtaking. Absolutely breathtaking. Many times we were in this part and seeing the uh, Medin Tower but this is way too beautiful how terrible some of the buildings are but still Istanbul's timeless beauty will swipe your feet away look at this place beautiful building in the world than this one simply. Almost 25 to 30 floor high. This is Ottoman Palace, obviously. Top of a palace. When they conquered Istanbul, they made this palace over Byzantine Palace. This is Top of a Palace. Once upon a time, world superpower the king, or sultan, was living here. Magnificent. 
magnificent Hagia Sophia. 1500 years old, almost still there, still majestic. Timeless, timeless view. This is, this is Bosporus, this is Marmara Sea, you can see the islands there, and the Bosporus bridge is there. Okay, Bosporus bridge is there. Okay, and uh, historical peninsula, Hagia Sophia, Sultan Ahmed, and also Suleimani Mosque is there. With, of course, this one is little straight going to do. Uh, inland, it's called Golden Horn. Very once upon a time, excuse me, chop uh, Once upon a time, it was uh, praised of its beauty and uh, nightlife. Absolutely 360. You can see the view. People, of course, taking some more videos. And it's like, yes. excuse me. Pardon, 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 pardon. And we are now around 360 completing the tour almost. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ah, yes. Now almost 360. Oh yes. I just love this place. The main view is actually here. The main view is actually here. Yes. This is, of course, you know the other side is Asia. Today's light is so different. Every day, different beauty you can find here. I would say. Inside again, yeah, it's so funny that I didn't notice this beautiful 1559. There was a painter guy who came to Istanbul and come up here and make a panoramic drawing of this Istanbul, the best example of its time. See how much detail it is here. Seriously, so beautiful. Look at that buildings all over these places. And that uh, so interesting enough, happened to be exact location they you see this is Hagia Sophia here. And if you look it up down here, you focus here, you will see Hagia Sophia here as well. Such a cool 
wheel and here is actually is on the drawing Hagia Sophia as well it's really cool check out this Hagia Sophia videos I have put it together later this is what I'm talking about he really jumped and successfully land about 1.6 km away and he was the first person was able to fly successfully. Mohamed, no pare, pericoloso, paura. Ay, Francesca, ya se me ha dicho. Helal olsun sana Ezerkan Ahmet Çelebi. Sen sadece ilk uçan insan olmakla kalmadın. Aynı zamanda bir kıtadan öbürüne uçan ilk insan olma imanını da kazandın. Helal olsun. Only a couple of minutes flight, but the first, believed to be first human 
that flow over the not only a successful flow of first person, the, the person who actually flow one continent to another one. Hazarfen Ahmed Cherebi. He <laughs> flew first time, like himself. So cool. The funicular, it connects between Karakoy to Taksim. It's about, it's about, I don't know, three kilometers up. But it's really pleasant to use this one instead of going up on a steep road. This is the representation of what's going on here. This tra train, where it goes. Go up here, all the way to Taksim Street. No, 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 it's much more steep than this, is, trust me. It will really kill you to go up here. That is actually the most comfortable way of traveling in Istanbul for the everyday people.